Hello everyone. Welcome to Gold Nugget, J-A-W underscore success. If this is your first time to the channel, let me welcome you. If you have already subscribed, let me thank you for joining me on this growth part. Today, my nugget is a symbiotic relationship. Now, somebody might say, this is not one of the type of relationship that we were taught in biology, right? There's a previous video that I did on types of relationship, and I want to pick up three of them. I want to pick up the mutual relationship, right? In a mutual relationship, which is close to what I'm talking about, a symbiotic relationship, both parties, right, um, benefit from the interaction. None is made worse because the other exists. Both grow, both can reproduce, both can reach to the level that they want to reach, right? And the environment is not destroyed because both exist in the same space. This is different from the commensual relationship where one, right, may benefit and the other may die. Or both may benefit, right, but it's not a, a close-knit, working together kind of thing, right? And the final one is the amensual relationship where it's a case where once something is established there, it sets itself where nothing else of any kind of liking can come into play, all right? The relationship that I'm talking about is a symbiotic relationship. Now, if we all watch the movie Spider-Man, we know that Venom is, is a villain, right? But in short, we have seen some twisting of Venom in the Spider-Man series over the years where there is a movie called Venom and this Venom is actually good, all right? But the relationship that I'm talking about, as I talk about symbiotic relationship, is a relationship in how we as individuals view ourselves versus how we view our job. Many of us love Fridays, but we hate Mondays. Why? Because Monday means going back to work. I personally don't have a problem with Monday and I enjoy work. I can be honest, there are some persons on the job that I don't really enjoy and we all can say that. Whether we are the CEO or we are the janitor, there are just some persons who we will try to work well with, we will give them the courtesy and we'll show them the level of cordiality that we want to show them, but we, will, we would rather if they leave or if we were in a position to leave, we would have rather left. But that's not what I'm talking about. My view in this symbiotic relationship is how do we see ourselves? Now, a symbiote can be a parasite. Now, your job or our job to us benefits us and gives us certain things that we would never have if we weren't working. Right? So the job plays an important role. And the company hired us because we can contribute in a particular way to the company. That's why one of the questions in an interview is, how do you see yourself contributing to this company? And you must know um, what you bring to the company. Some individuals, they will not bring a laughter they will not bring a pleasing personality but they will bring technical skills and they will bring certain insight and they will bring you know a level of moving the company forward from a financial perspective but when it comes on to people persons they are not really people person but that's not even what i'm talking about in this video or this nugget what i'm talking about in this nugget is how do you work with your job? Now, here comes the balance. If you go to work because 
of the salary, then you're a parasite. You become the parasite. If I go to work because of just the money, then I become a parasite to the job. Why? Because our job to us should be more than just getting a salary at the end of the day. It should be where we grow, we expand. There's another video that I spoke about something similar to this. But in this video, I'm talking about how we grow, how we expand, how we, we our life become better for working where we are working and how um, the relationship on the job, outside of the job is, is better. So when we leave work, even though we have left work, we still look forward to going back to work because there is this kind of mutuality that we are getting from it. However, the job becomes the parasite if it does not facilitate you growing and all you get from going to work is just the money. Why the job become a parasite? Because guess what? If the job doesn't facilitate you growing, when the job is finished with you, you're done. When the new technology is introduced, you're done. When you are too old and new, younger, fresh blood come in, you're done. So when you are working somewhere, because of a symbiotic relationship, the company is becoming better. The business is growing and expanding. People find a pleasure to come into the company, into the office, because there is a pleasant staff in there, a staff that is growing, a staff that is well-rounded, a staff that is happy to be where they are. From an ergonomical standpoint, they are, they are, the place is just a great place to work. From an emotional standpoint, it's a supportive place to work. From a financial standpoint, it is meeting the needs of the a financial capacity of its staff. It's just a all-round great place to work. The managers are not overbearing or micromanaging and all of that kind of stuff. It's just a great place to work. So I am growing, so I'm putting out my all. I'm putting out my best, right? That's how it is supposed to be. However, if the company is growing in leaps and bounds, but you are stifled, it's a parasitic relationship. Because I can assure you, as soon as they don't have any use for you anymore, they can make you redundant, or they say you don't redundant people, you redundant the position. So look at your position in the job and see if it's a position that is integral to the company and how much contribution you are making to the company in order to be there. Because guess what? In a symbiotic relationship, both creature, so to speak, live and expand and grow. And a matter of fact, personalities blend. That's why some individuals, when you, when you talk to them, it's as if you're talking to their company. Right, Because they are so much a part of their job and their job is so much a part of them. They're not worker Alex, but they have taken on such value from the company that their life is expanded and their, the company is expanded because of them. They talk well and pleasing about the company and they don't want to leave. So ask yourself, do you have a symbiotic relationship in your job or do you have a parasitic one? This is J.A.W. saying, if you have a symbiotic relationship in your job, you're going to grow, you're going to expand, the company is going to grow, and the company is going to expand. But if it is not symbiotic, one is going to grow and one is going to die. And because this is a spirit and life video for individuals and not so much the company, I am saying make sure that you are not the one that dies because guess what? At the end of the day, what you want to do is grow wherever you are. Bloom where you are planted. Grow and expand because that's what life is. This is J.A.W. saying, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and share. Bye.